Greetings to the FileMaker developers in Sydney and sorry for not being there. Maybe next time. So, welcome to the presentation about the MBS FileMaker plugin. My name is Christian Schmitz and I am the CEO of MonkeyPred Software. The MBS plugin has been in development for 17 years already. And we got over 7000 functions already to help you solve the problems for your clients. Our plugin supports MacOS, Windows, iOS and Linux, including the new ARM servers. We support both the FileMaker and Claris platforms. You can use the plugin in FileMaker Pro or Claris Pro on servers with Data API, WebDirect, Scheduled Scripts and PSOS. And you can use the plugin within your iOS SDK made apps. And our plugin still works on older versions of FileMaker as well as the latest one. Let's talk about a few feature highlights. You can work with PDF documents using our plugin. For example, merge some documents and add page numbers or links. Then you can pick the printer and paper formats, move around windows and control the web viewer to evaluate JavaScript or take a picture. We have examples for using curl to do upload and downloads with SFTP or Amazon S3, examples to send and receive emails. You can connect to other databases and move records over to MongoDB or various SQL servers. Scan documents, edit them and run text recognition. And if you like JavaScript, we can even run it without a web viewer. For macOS, we have a lot of enhancements to the script workspace, like a search feature and coloring of script lines. New this year are OCR functions for Windows. We use a built-in text recognition from Microsoft and you can install several languages and system settings. We added PDF functions specifically for Windows, so you can load a PDF document from a container field or a file and query metadata like the number of pages. Then you can render preview pictures from individual pages. For our script search, we added regular expressions. So if enabled, you can search with wildcards to, for example, find all variables starting with $C and ending with a T. In the debugger, you may have seen tooltips showing you the values of variables or fields. Recently, we added a command to the context store menu to copy the value. Please try the plugin. Download it on our website and maybe request a trial license. Check out the documentation. Read news in our blog. And if you need a license, we have a discount for you. Thank you for listening and enjoy the conference.